Hey everybody, thanks for watching another video. Richard Hill here. Today we are talking about Canva. Canva is an amazing tool to use if you're tired of taking forever to create your social media images, your ad images, even blog titles, anything image and design related. Canva can really, really help you save time, money, and effort. Canva is actually a free tool and a pay tool, but you can use the free tool and there's a bunch of benefits from to using it. So without further ado, let's head to the screen. So right now I'm inside Canva and you can see all the different things that we can design. Canva has an awesome editor that's going to allow you to pretty much create anything that you want. For me, it was buying images. I would spend 10, 20, 50 dollars on images and even more for graphic design work when I was getting blog titles made for the blogs and the websites. I have a lot of websites, 40, 50 websites right now. So having enough images and all is always struggling. And even when I had just a few websites, I was always struggling to come up with new ideas and create this, create that. And the design is such an important part of the process. It's very important for branding. You know, you, you want your logo and your images. You know, you want the brand colors to be correct. Um, you don't want your marketing to be here and there. You don't want it to be off. That's another lesson you can take away. You know, you want to keep your brand, brand image consistent throughout no matter what you're doing and as it relates to design but message copy but that's for another video but specifically look at, at social media and images and designs in general man it can take a lot of time when you're creating it all i don't know if you've ever been in, within adobe photoshop that shit's hard to learn i don't care who you are that's hard to learn i didn't have enough time sit down for hours upon hours to try to learn that. I needed a simple solution, an affordable solution, and Canva is that and a lot more. Back to the screen, if you look, there's a bunch of different things that we create within Canva. And again, it's free. All this right here in front of you, you can access for free. There is paid accounts. I do have a paid account, but everything that you're seeing and that we'll be talking about it's free. You get a few more benefits, but for the most part, you can get by with a free account and even a paid account. Ten, twelve dollars a month. It's really not going to bother you. So, presentations, and, and you'll see the pixel size showing up right here. So we can see exactly what we can create: Facebook posts, social media posts, blog titles, logos, covers for Facebook. Instagram posts, Twitter posts, and, and even when you go down here, we can see that we can create letterheads, U.S. letters, certificates, resumes, wallpapers for desktop, blog graphics, infographics, you know, real estate flyers, um, business cards. There's just a ton of different stuff that you can create in Canva, and I'm going to show you. It's real, real simple. That's why I love this tool. I'm not associated with them. I know a few people that work there, but I'm not being endorsed or being paid to, to do this video. I'm just trying to help you guys out. It's a very, very powerful tool that's very easy to use and easy to learn. A great interface, easy to navigate, and that's why I like it so much. So for the sake of an example, I'm going to show you the Canva editor in the back end. So uh, we'll use the Facebook post. So when we click this, this is going to take us inside the back end of uh, Canva. And we're going to see the editor and all the different layouts and elements that Canva has to offer. So all your little elements that you can add is going to be over here on this left hand side. And these are different layouts that we can use uh, specifically for the Facebook post. This is going to be our pixel diagram right here. So all of these are going to fit perfectly. Uh, 
we can use any one of these and you'll notice a little free tag here as long as it says free it's going to be free to use so you'll be able to use it download it create whatever you want and you're not going to be charged for it and even the paid pictures they're only a dollar a piece so think about that you know when I was buying any of these I was paying as high as fifty dollars and Canva has a lot of high quality pictures and we'll show you a little bit of those here in a little bit but let's look and try to find something that a template that we can edit this to show and we'll use this one so you can see it perfectly fits it's very clear it would definitely get your attention so for the second example, I click on the text and up here on the top we can see this is going to be our fonts. It's going to be our font size, the color of the selected element. We have bold italic, you can center the text, capitalize all the letters. We got space in the options where we can increase the letter space and decrease it, or we can adjust the line height. Uh, to whatever we want. So let me kind of put that back. So for the sake of that, you can see that everything in here is going to be drag and drop. Unless it's one of these top elements, but even these can kind of be moved around as you want. And you can see the colors that we get up here. So this is going to match the white red and, and yellow frame so when we click up here it's going to usually gives you options if you have an option to change it to a different palette so if we click on that that's going to go ahead and change all of those blues and, and we can change them any color um, you'll notice that it says brand colors here that's because Canva allows you to preload your brand colors to preload your brand fonts that way it's very easy to access with canva it, it's all about efficiency for me it's i can come in and get stuff done in a matter of minutes and, and it used to take me you know 30 minutes to an hour just to come up with a design even like this at least even if you're good at design it's going to cut your time in half and, and that's a one of the biggest things that I love about Canva it saves me time and effort and eventually that saves me money and all of the free most of the stuff in Canva is going to be free so don't worry about having a paid account you don't need it you, there's, there's enough that you could do if you want to get a paid account that's fine but you don't necessarily need it there's a lot of things that you can do within Canva just with a free account so right now I'm on my text we can change this to any color that we want simple if pre-populated you get 15 colors these are our brand colors but we can see the different colors that's involved in the template they will show up here at the main top but if you, you don't see your color I do and you're going to get every color right here and just drag and drop it's very very simple you can find exactly what you want just change it drag it everything's drag and drop so very very simple so if we wanted to change the text there's probably a few hundred fonts on here but you can also upload your fonts so if your branded font is not on here you'll have the option to upload it and they will appear up here as you can see uh, one of the clients that i work with has uh, georgia as a font we uploaded it for them and just like that we're able to change it so and again it's very very simple so we can just click on edit so the yellows we can change specifically that the whites it's going to pre-populate up here we can change you know and I'll change the 
speckles. So each element, yeah, that's exactly what it is. So you can actually even change the little, uh, the little graffiti there, which is really, really cool. So if you wanted to change them orange, you can even change the other graffiti to, um, yellow. Yeah. So it's really, really cool. So as you can see, we just come over here. We was able to change this whole top row. And if we wanted to go through them individually, we're able to do that. And we can change it to any color that we want. And you can see how simple it is. It's simple drag and drop. Now, all elements on the templates are not changeable. You want to find some templates that don't change everything. But for the most part, just like this one, you can pretty much change everything within it and it's simple very very simple we can drag drop we can put these wherever we want just by dragging and drop center you got your little center lines that come up where you're able to line up text and line up different elements very very easy to do now over here on the left this is your navigation this is where all the magic happens this is where you're able to find everything you can see free photos so let's look at the photos here real quick as you can notice these are real high quality photos and all these we have access for free and there's a bunch of them so if we come over let's see here let's, let's remove these I'm going to actually go ahead and back out and we'll go ahead and come back in and do another Facebook post. I imagine most people are going to be doing Facebook posts anyway. Let's go back over here. Elements, free photos. I want to show you how high quality these, these photos are. So, here's a good one. Yeah, let's try this one. Yeah, yeah. So. We got a lake here, and you can see this picture is small. It's not as big as we need it for a Facebook post. So all we have to do is click on it. We get our corners where we're able to drag and drop. And we can increase the size of this photo. And as you can clearly see, you're not losing any resolution. It's still a high quality picture. Just like it was when it was small. All of Canvas pictures are this way. You will not have a problem with them. You can create them as small as you want. You can create them pretty much as large as you want. It's very, very easy to do. Here's a picture of the stars at night. And you still get that high quality picture which is amazing and all these pictures are free these are all pictures that you can use for your social media marketing you can use it for blogs you can use it for designs on letters anything that you want to you can come over here and as long as it's free you can use it and even the paid images one dollar. Most of them are one dollar. They may all be a dollar. I'm not 100% sure on that, but every one that I've seen has only been a dollar. And you can't be a high quality photo like this for only a dollar. Again, in any of y'all that's bought photos and stuff like that, you'll find that out if you haven't. That pictures cost a lot of money to go to all these other websites. So we'll use this picture for an example. So I clicked on the text. We can add any of these texts that we want. And it's very easy to change. We can drag anywhere that we want to. We can click on it, highlight it. We can make it bigger. 
and we can drag that out. That way it all shows on the same. And we can center this, see the little purple line. It'll let you know that it's dead center. We can change this to white and show up better if we wanted to. If we didn't like the text, uh, we can come up here and we can change it to any type of font that we want. Can't really tell much of a change there. There we go. Yeah, and, and it's that simple. It's very, very easy to do. If we come back over to Elements, let's see. And we have a bunch of different things we can do. From frames and grids, these will help you. If you, for example, will click on grids. So, if you ever wonder how people get these side by side pictures or they're four, you know, 25, 25, 25, kind of like right here, this is one way that you can do that. So, you can come over here and you can create this. You can go back, grab your pictures. And we can open this up and we can add a picture here. Picture in that corner. Picture down here. And a picture right there. And while this one don't look great, of course I could erase that, but it actually has a white line where add that right there even though that don't look right so let me do it like this that way you can see because it really really looks good when you're able to do this and we'll pre-populate these and just drag and drop choose whatever picture that you want right there that's much better without that picture in the background and you can see that it shows up awesome and all you have to do is come up here call it whatever that you want press done and just hit download it asks you if you want a transparent background in this case we don't PNG that's recommended download it and it will download and it will save your file and then you'll be able to go over to Facebook and post it I mean it's that simple it's so so easy to do and again that, that's what I love about it the most there's so much that you can do with it and it's simple I love how they've designed it I love all the different things they've added to it um, there's just so much that you can do they have icons where we can go through these different icons. If we wanted to add this, we can make these as small or as big as we want. As you can see, the color over here highlights. If we click on it, we can change this to pretty much any color that we want. And we can use any type of icons that's over here listed for free. Just drag it over and you can have a lot of fun. You know, some. I mean, even some of these could be made into logos. You know, I don't know if you're into SEO or doing PBNs and different things like that, where you're making a bunch of different websites, but there's a lot of different things that you can use these icons for. You know, you may find one that um, you want to use on your website, like this check mark, where uh, maybe you have a little checklist that you want to add this to, uh, maybe green, because highlighting the benefits and different things like that. If we wanted to duplicate them, we can come over here, copy, 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 copy. And we can make as many as we want. And we'll be able to equally line these up. You can see the lines that show up once you're there. Or you can equally get all of them lined up. If you're just creating some type of checklist, some downloadable checklist to collect leads or, you know, whatever it may be. There's a lot that you can do here. So lines, um, again, with your letters and different things like that, there's a bunch of them over here that we can add. Just 
drag them over just like that. We can increase the size, make a stretch all the way over, get some of these out of the way. One into a, maybe we're making some kind of letterhead or something like that. Come over here and make a few copies where we can add them to the edges, maybe one in the middle, or however you want to design it. I mean, there's no specific right way or wrong way here. Maybe we want to add a little bit of text here. And you can kind of start lining things up um, and you got even these little pre-populated things where we can come over here and add something maybe this is a little area maybe we're creating a newsletter or something like that and we can make another one I want to change this to orange or just you know just showing you little little different things there's so much that you can do and you, I'm sure once you're looking at it you can see that wow this, this is a tool that's useful valuable I would definitely pay which, which I do pay for it but it's a tool that is well worth being free if that's possible I have a few more things that we can use. Uh, icons. We talked about lines, uh, shapes. These are just shapes like squares, triangles, uh, pictures of people doing different things. Um, again, you got high quality. There's somebody walking through, uh, walking through a field. If we wanted to increase it, we can. We still get that quality. And a lot of these, um, if you haven't been on Canva, if you're not familiar with Canva, uh, for those of you that are, um, they just added these with the last few months. Um, got seasonal, uh, seasonal uh, pictures here. See a lot of snow. And again, they've added a lot of pictures here recently, and there's so many that's for free. Um, you can literally find anything here. See, uh, we deal a lot with real estate, doing real estate marketing, real estate stuff like that. There's a real estate section now. So you're getting houses and different things like that, interior. Um, again, all high quality photos. They're free, so you can use them pretty much in anything that you want. That's what makes Canva really awesome. So um, I appreciate everybody watching the video. Um, I would definitely recommend that you come over to Canva and give it a try. Again, it's free. It's well worth giving your email and, and create an account. Get signed up with a free account. The paid account, uh, you could do without. Really, if you want to get the paid account, you're going to get more access to pictures. Uh, I think I paid 10 $12 a month, but that's nothing. That cost me one photo, if I'm lucky, you know, doing it the other way. So Canva, five stars out of five stars for sure. And definitely, definitely worth it. And come over and check it out. Appreciate everybody watching the video and coming to the channel. Please subscribe, please like, please share. It's always greatly appreciated. And I will catch you guys later.